Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel, and this is to um, answer a few questions I've seen quite repeatedly on the uh, previous videos of the launch of Windows 10 May 2020 update. First, a lot of people, um, I've I had a few people tell me that, uh, well, they probably pulled the uh, update. They didn't. Uh, it's not pulled. It's still available, and some people are still upgrading. But it's going very, very slow, and which is what you want. Now, um, some of you will have a message in your Windows updates if you go to settings and go into the update and security. It will tell you when you check for updates, there's a new update available, but your machine is not compatible yet. When that is showing up, it's simply telling you that the update isn't, uh, there's something on your PC, it could be hardware drivers, it could be software you have, if you see that message, you know, eventually it'll, it's, it's going to be fixed and it's going to work. Uh, just hang in there. Uh, there should be, uh, you know, it will appear at some point and there's no rush, like I say. Second of all, uh, a lot of people that got it, of course, seem to be happy and have uh, a, a perfectly working computer. One of the things that uh, you should check if you have, there's two errors that can pop up or there's an, an, a problem with the install that can pop up if you're using uh, memory integrity feature uh, in the core isolation. So in the settings, if you go into your system settings, there's something called core isolation and there's a feature called memory integrity that prevents attacks from inserting malicious code. If that is turned on on your PC, this Windows update is not, this May 2020 update is not going to install it crashes with an error message and rolls back. Just turn that off and you'll see that your update is actually going to work. So you need to turn off memory integrity for this to actually show up. For those of you that don't see it, it's just that either the servers are not yet um, giving you the possibility to update because not everybody is seeing it. It's a very small amount of people that actually are seeing it on their machines. And it is possible that that's where you are. It's just not available for you yet. The other thing, which is also plausible, is your machine isn't ready for that. It's going to be ready at some point. So don't look at Windows Update every 10 minutes. Uh, you're wasting your time. If you don't see it, you know, check in a week, a few weeks, a month, it'll, it'll appear at some point, but don't look at a Windows Update every, you know, 20 times a day. It's, it's not going to change anything. It's not there. It's because your machine possibly has something that's not ready yet for it to be okay on your machine. That's it. There are driver issues. There are some programs that might not be compatible. If you use third-party antivirus, a lot of them are not compatible yet. All of that is going to prevent you. It's going to stop the update from actually getting to your machine. If you don't see it, it doesn't matter. You know what? You'll have it at some point. Uh, remember, it is an optional update. Some people are saying, no, this is not optional. It installed. No, you clicked download and install. It's optional. If Even if you check for Windows Update, it's going to tell you that an update is available, but it's not going to install until you click download and install. The... Um, Features of the uh, Windows 10 May 2020 update. There's quite a few little features here and there. I'll be making a very quick review of the full features very, very fast. I've already talked about all most of these features on the channel, so you should have that uh, available. Remember, there are known issues. There's a few things that are not working right, especially if you got Realtek Bluetooth drivers it's possible that if you have more than one bluetooth device that it actually doesn't connect well uh, things like that it is a known issues look at my video that talks about the known issues there's a page there that uh, sh shows you everything that right now they're working on that should be fixed at some point the rollout's still continuing but like i said a lot of you are not seeing it yet and that's normal and that's okay You'll get it eventually when that is available for you. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.